Here we have the acromion and the clavicle. So this is the acromioclavicular ligament. We have the coracoid. So this is the coracoacromio ligament. The coracoclavicular ligaments. And then we have from the base back here, going all the way down to here, the coracohumeral ligament. And then finally, up front on the anterior side, we have the glenohumeral ligament. Here we have the medial epicondyle, which means this is our ulna on the medial side. So here we have the ulnar collateral ligament. On the lateral side, if you follow the striations, you're going of the bone and the striations of the ligament, they about follow the same length is the radial collateral ligament and then the striations on this bottom ligament are perpendicular with the bone that is your annular ligament for your knee from the patella down to the tibia is your patellar ligament. Behind it, you have your anterior cruciate ligament, which comes from the back, the posterior superior side, and comes anterior and inferior. Here you have your fibula, which is on your lateral side of your leg. So that makes this your lateral collateral ligament, and this your lateral meniscus. The tibia is on the medial side, so that makes this your medial collateral ligament, and that this your medial meniscus. On the back side, we have Going almost straight up and down is your posterior cruciate ligament. And we can also see where the anterior cruciate ligament starts to go in and back and towards the front. Here we have our iliac crest, so that makes this over here. 